Right, let's see. This is my new outfit I bought today. As you can see, it's a fancy t-shirt. And a nice jacket. You can probably see the jacket better here. It's a nice jacket. Goes well with my glasses. And this is the new hat I got. I don't know what brand it is, but the label says Ben Sherman. Whatever that means. And I should probably is imported from America apparently. On the back it says that it's not for sale outside America or Mexico. Which is a good thing because if it was the Australian copy they would have censored it because this game bungled as a as, at the OFLC. As you can see they stuck an M sticker over the PG sticker. Which is further proof that my country is a country filled with prudes. If they can't deal with Dragon Ball, they can't deal with anything. I mean, honestly. Is Goku's Wang that dangerous to society? I don't think it is. Anyway, this is also a good game for DS. I suggest you, get, you find it if you can, because it's one of the only it's one of the only original Dragon Ball games out there which is actually good and it doesn't pull any punches with the storyline it keeps the source material and I enjoyed it it's kinda like Phantom Hourglass if it was Dragon Ball only it's a lot less frustrating and you collect figures in the game that you collect and, and they move around and stuff. I don't know. I haven't checked those features out yet. Anyway, what else? Well, I got plenty of these disc things on sale at Office Works, so you can count on me. But, you know, some people are cheap. I don't know. It's a good game, even though Yahtzee kind of trashed it. But I think it's the best GTA game I've ever played. GTA 4 was kind of... Yeah. 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 I didn't like GTA 4 as much as... Making more videos soon. Now, where did the case for the arm go? Ah, damn it. Excuse me for a moment. Ah, found the case. That's good. Anyway, what else? Um. Uh, right. Well. Recently, there's been a bit of kerfuffle over the lack of the R18 certificate for video games that there is for movies. I mean, if this country made Mad Max, I think we can deal with video games which are kind of violent. I mean, Mad Max was pretty violent and they gave that a certificate. And yet they don't give GTA a, a certificate, even though it needs one. You know, I don't know. The average 15 year old is not ready for Grand Theft Auto 4. It's just, their heads would explode from the context and subtext of the plot lines. I don't know. I'm not the most character blogger, video blogger that there is around, so you might not notice my head moving a lot because I'm a bit stiff when I'm in front of a camera. I don't know. 
Maybe this is enough. Uh, this is my first time doing this, so bear in mind that. Right. Go through the things that have been happening in the world this week. First up, Chinatown Wars. Nobody's buying this game because everybody's pirating it, which is annoying. If you like this game, you might as well buy it, like I did. Um, let's see. Well, apart from that, it's pretty dull around my house because my grandma broke her hip and my mum's gone to visit her and, took the ta and she's taken the car so I'm stuck in the house for about a day or so so I have to figure out what to do with myself while well, and before she comes back with the car so I can actually go to the city and stuff but there's always public transport but that it takes half an hour for the five or four of us to get to my stop which is annoying and the, and the transport authority won't give me a bus pass because I'm over 19 and still a student. What kind of bollocks is that? Just because I'm over 19, they won't give me a free bus pass for the transport authority so I can get to school like everyone else. I didn't choose to do Pathway 2. Anyway, for you Americans who don't know what Pathways is, it's how you do your HSC, which is the equivalent of the SATs in Australia. And Pathways is doing that over a number of years instead of straight in a single year, which would have been hell for me. Anyway, it's gone on up to nine minutes, so I think we can stop for now. Okay, see you next time.